He's live and alive. And you know... <laughs> I'm not going to do that. I was going to make a Felix-style joke. Felix made this exact same joke on Chapo. About how, you know, it's a controversial point. You know, some people agree with what he did. Some people don't. <laughs> but... He is. He is a. He is a true entertainer. Uh, if if only he wasn't such a fucking freak, bitch. Okay. But let's hear what he has to say here. So I'm almost done here. So uh, you pretend to be a journalist, and you want to look at people like me so you can say you're the good guy. I think. I think you're on trial, though, right? For not having no, the corporate media is on trial, and so is the rigged judiciary. Yes, here. Rest, Damn, right? fucking own, dude. Look at that. Whoop. That's that is straight up, straight up fucking ninjutsu right there. He did he did kung fu on his ass, dude. Mental mental kung fu. He said, "I'm not on trial. Corporate media is on trial." Boom. You just activated my trap card. But you literally no, no, no. today are no. on trial. No, you just on to trial. clarify, you were on trial. I'm not. You're on trial. Okay. In his life. Failed Soros propped up. It's kind of wild, bro. You really know this man's a DJ. Okay, look at time. him twirling that little sig. Look at it. Look at the little sig twirl right there. That's like, that's next level shit. You do that when you're like, w when you're just a fucking addict. Okay. Failed Soros propped up corporate media. All right. You're nothing but a pirate. All right, Ray, talk. It'd be so cool if Alex Jones went home every night, took a deep breath, and talked in a normal speaking voice, which sounds like Lindsey Graham or something. Yeah. It's like, <laughs> ah, all right, I'm finally done. I'm finally done with this bullshit. We have similar questions. Uh, there was some confusion about what... Bullshit. Guess we can rest Just litters casually? Come on, bro. He's fucking smoking cigs. Nick Mullins on Alex Jones? Oh, I already saw this. In a hundred years, people are going to look back on Alex Jones and it's going to be like, Mozart, uh, Van Gogh, Alex Jones, right? Because he's, he's a fucking artist. You don't turn that red unless you're doing something with your heart. That's like, good. That's, that's passion. And then they fucking killed him. And during the pandemic, he got replaced by all of these like conspiracy theorists that are just like grifters essentially they're all like math weenies that want to talk about like covid numbers every single one of them they're like subscribe to my Substack, and we can take a look at the charts and it's like take a look at the charts <laughs> suck my <laughs> tell the parkland shooting victims of their face that they're lying that's a conspiracy theory. that's conspiracy yeah they're like the uk health agency forgot to carry a one no 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 Barack Obama was having gay s for cocaine money during the Benghazi attacks. That's like music to my ears. He's so right. Except Alex Jones is so cucked now. I mean, this is something, this is, this is again, another fucking uh, Felix take, but it's true. He is so incredibly fucking cucked. My man is, my man went from like, you know, uh, uh, attacking George W. Bush and Barack Obama to like having a person that literally went on his broadcast, become the president, and he couldn't even ask him to fucking uncover, like, the 9-11 shit, you know what I mean? He's so cucked. It's sad to see the fall from grace. You know what I mean? It's just so sad to see some of your faves... Some of your faves fall from grace so dramatically, you know what I mean? Thank you for killing Comtown so Nick can pursue his real passion, making Adam into a megastar. Bro, here's what I'll say about that, okay? Um, I know you're joking, but there's...